If you're planning to start a gaming channel, you may not know where to begin. The best thing you can start with is a great screen recorder for your PC or emulated games. There are a lot of good programs out there, but with the updates to Windows 10 and other various advancements, some have fallen behind, like Fraps. Open Broadcaster software is a great tool for streaming, but if you want to record your games or tutorials, you need Mirrorless Action. Action is a small, easy-to-use desktop recorder program, and it's one of the best I've used in a long time. I'm actually using it to record this video and my previous gameplay videos. Its interface is easy to move around in, and it takes very little effort to record a video. It has three different ways to record. Games and Applications, Active Desktop, and Active Desktop Region. It supports AVI or MP4, though the MP4 is kind of laggy at times. You can set the resolution up to 1080p, and they're steadily integrating 4K support as well. Of course, you need a 4K monitor to record in that size. You can set the frame rate up to 60 FPS, though 30 is recommended to lower your file sizes, and those can get pretty large at times. You can set a time limit with duration to keep recording videos to a certain length. It has the perfect video match mode where, if you decide to record web videos or videos from various media players, your recording matches with the source. Multi-channel audio allows you to record with 5.1 surround sound or stereo. Action also has a live stream option to fiddle around with, but it's not the best. You're better off using OBS to stream, but if you really want to, you can connect Action with YouTube, Twitch, Ustream, and various others to display your gameplay. You can also record your stream to submit highlights to your channel. The next tab has a remote control option. Using an Android device, you can start, pause, and stop recordings without having to interact with the program on the PC. Your Android device will also display frame rate, recording time, and free disk space remaining. It's very useful if you want to avoid unnecessary mouse clicks or key presses. The audio recording tab lets you record audio by itself if you want. You can set a duration just like the screen recording, as well as allow multi-channel audio recording. That's the 5.1 surround sound or stereo. You can also enable or disable recording silence. Action allows to benchmark desktop and all supported DirectX or OpenGL games and application performance. They're saved as CSV files, but I haven't done too much with this. But I'm sure if you want to overclock your stuff, this is a great tool for you to measure your results with. As with most tools like this, you can take high-quality screenshots. Not too special, but always appreciated. And finally, there are multiple settings that you can go through to make your videos look better than ever. You can select the usual startup options, minimize, keep application on top, you know the drill. You can set your video quality and bitrate for MP4, and your input range for your lightness and darkness. Multicore recording is a performance option. With it unselected, it will improve performance, but it could affect your video quality, so I recommend keeping it checked. You can also record your mouse cursor and visualization of mouse clicks. Here, you can put an overlay graphic for videos or streaming, like if you want to put a watermark or something else like that. And here you can set your webcam recording options and resolution, your microphone settings, what you want to record with, you can move your HUD around, which displays your FPS information, how you want them exported, and various hotkeys if you don't want to click everything. All in all, Action is one of the best programs I've ever used for screen recording. With just a few keystrokes and mouse clicks, you can export your gameplay video in a matter of minutes. With the iteration of Windows 10, Fraps isn't the best thing to use anymore. There are lots of issues with it, and sometimes it completely breaks. The last time it was updated was about three years ago. Action was recently updated in August, so they're still working on it and plan to keep it going for a long time. With the 4K support, we can see that it's going to be one of the best ones to use even with higher resolution. Whether you're a beginner or experienced with creating videos, you have to admit that this is one of the best programs out there. If you want to try it out, there is a 30-day free trial with Action. However, its $30 price tag makes it cheaper than Fraps. I started my gaming channel with this, and so can you. It's really that easy. Just play your game, and with a few keystrokes and a few mouse clicks, you'll have your video to put on your channel. I hope this video points you in the right direction with whatever you need to do. Whether you're doing a game channel or just making tutorials for people, Action is a great choice to get your videos going.